Hey guys, it's Brett. So I thought I would do a candle and wax melt collection video. I don't think I've actually ever done one before. I do think I showed on one of our vlogs my candle collection, but that was like, gosh, I want to say maybe four or five years ago, maybe. And my collection has grown considerably since then. This is not a lot compared to most people's collections in the candle community. Most people have way more than I have, but this is quite a bit for me. Like I said, this is the most that I've ever had. Um, this is a mixture of candles that were sent to me for PR and candles that I purchased myself. So I wanted to show what I have because these are just kind of fun to do. I like watching them. I'm not going to go over the scents or anything because that'll just take way too long. I'm just going to show you pretty much what I have. I have them all throughout my apartment in different areas. So I'm just going to kind of grab and go and show you what I got. So right here, I have these candles here, right here. We have our TV and our fireplace here. And I have, we have these little shelves on the side of our fireplace. So I needed some more room. So I just stuck some right here on this little shelving area here to put my candles. So we have mold wine from Homeworks. Honey glazed pear from Homeworks. Frozen balsam. Most of these are homeworks over on this side here. Cranberry wreath from homeworks. This was out last year, last uh, this past holiday season. I never did get a chance to burn that yet. So I'm excited to try that probably this coming holiday season. So, so like I said, some of these were PR and sometimes they will send so many PR that I will do videos about them and share them, but I don't always have time to burn them because sometimes they send so many at a time and I work full time for whatever job. I don't always have, I don't have, it's really hard to get through all these candles when they send you so many at one time. So I try to burn as many as I can, but sometimes I just can't get to all of them. But like I said, I do hauls and share them with you and let you know what I think of them and post pictures on my Instagram and all that stuff to promote them. But I don't always get a chance to burn them, but I do eventually get to them. Hot cider donut. We have Tree Farm Lane, Lemoncello Cupcake, Caramel Apple Spiced Tea, Balsam White Birch, Winter Fireside. Back here we have Cozy Knit Blanket. We have Crackling Fireside. On the other side, back to back, we have another winter fireside and eucalyptus oak. And then on this side, we have some scent works. We have vanilla sugar, sugar cookie, lilac breeze, and lavender mandarin. And then this one is from Aroma Home by HS Works. These are available at uh, Home Depot. This is cinnamon sugar cookie. I had that. I had another one. This is, I went and got another one because this was so good. This smells a lot like cinnamon sugar donut, cinnamon French toast kind of combined. It's really good. So I had to buy another one. And these are only like $9.99. So I picked that one up and okay, let me see. I just did a video, a haul video of some new candles I got. So I figured since I had them out, I will just show you all my other candles. Uh, this is Pink Lemon Shortbread. These just came out and I just ordered them, got them from Homeworks. White Sand Verbena is new. Coconut Cake. They brought that back. And there's Phoebe. Berry Trifle. They brought that back too. So excited. And I love that jar. And then Homeworks also sent me these five returning ones to share with you all. And I just did, uh, just showed these in my video as well. These are returning scents. Mandarin Pink Grapefruit. Pineapple Colada. Driftwood. Another hot cider donut. That's amazing. And then... Enchanted Peony. Okay, and now let's go over here. I have a little shelf here that I have my other candles on. 
I have three little shelves here. I have a little mixture of homeworks, scent works, and bath and body works in this one. I think there's a few Yankees in here too. So we have from homeworks, we have Orchard Nectar. Orchard Nectar there. That's in the three wicks with the wood lid. We have Wild Peony. The three wicks. Then we have Honeycrisp Orchard. We have Citrus Mojito, if it'll focus. It's glaring really bad. There we go. And we have Blood Orange and Apricot. We have scent works here. We have cinnamon wreath, hot apple cider. And back there we have my love from scent works and crisp red apple from scent works. And then we have from homeworks key lime macaron and coconut palm. And on this side we have some bath and body works. We have dark amber and oud. I just Bought these a few weeks ago. Did a haul of those. We have lavender vetiver. We have sugared orange and vanilla. And we have fireside. This was from winter 2020, I believe. And then we have a tis the season. And then down here, next row, we have this is my mom gave this to me this is bougie perfume perfumed candle tyler candle company and this is it says on the bottom here it is what is the scent on this french vanilla oak it smells really good but she can't burn candles anymore because her boyfriend has copd and candles really bother his breathing, so she gave that to me. And then we have from Homeworks, Wild Raspberry and Lemon Flower. And Holiday Wishes from Homeworks as well. Then Homeworks Pine Needles. Strawberry Rhubarb, amazing, I love that one so much. And South Seas Gardenia. And then back here we have Honeysuckle Mimosa from Homeworks. And we have Lemon and Laurel Leaf. It's glaring a little bit again. And then down here, this one, what is this? I think that's uh, Fresh Cotton Clouds, I believe. On the bottom there. Let me see. Yes, Fresh Cotton Clouds. And then over here from Homeworks, we have Island Petals and Apple Pumpkin Pie. And then we have a few Yankees back here. We have White Christmas. That is my favorite Christmas scent of all time. Love that one. That's in the two wick paraffin from Yankee. Then we have a Yankee Candles Sparkling Cinnamon in the two wick tumbler. And then over here we have Yankee Candles Frosted Fur. And that's in the uh, two wick. I forget what's. Oh, which ones? Sorry, it's kind of dusty. <laughs> really dusty. I don't remember what they call those. those that sh candle. It's called something. I forget the name of that candle. The style of candle. All right, and then. Down here in the bottom, we have Blushing Camellia from Homeworks. Apricot and Beach Sage from Homeworks and Water Lily and Neroli from Homeworks and then I have these little one wicks from Homeworks. We have Energize which is Mandarin and Ginger and then another one wick from Homeworks and Island Palm and then a few Scentworks over here. We have Spiced Mold Wine from Scentworks and Toasted Pumpkin S'mores from Scentworks get back here we 
have poppy fields from Homeworks and hibiscus flower from Homeworks. And then on the bottom, uh, let me check because I'm not going to remember all the names of these because they don't have the name on the outside. The, what do they call these? Special edition jars. I don't remember what this one called. Is it Chevron or something? Oh gosh, these those lids come off so easy. This is Blackberry Rose right here. Goodness sakes. Okay. And then over here we have Peppermint Amaryllis. Try not to drop those lids. And this one, oh, iced tube rose. That one. Oh gosh. Shambles. Let me just take that out of there. Okay. Oh, and then lastly, this one is rosewood plum. Okay. And then on the other side. We have Sugar Plum Blackberry and Midnight Leaves. So that is all for this shelving area here. And then I have some more in my bedroom closet. Okay, and in our bedroom closet here, we have this little shelving area here. So I have some candles up here as well. So right here we have this. This is a, oh, a hurricane that Homer has sent me. This one of their summer hurricanes. It's got the pillar candle in there, really pretty. I put that on our uh, kitchen table during uh, the summer. And then here we have the long beloved smoked pumpkin woods from 2000, this was the fall 2017. This was like the very first fall of the homers came out. This has never came back. I cannot believe it has never came back yet. That was so popular. So I have one here and I have just a little bit left of this one. So yeah, I some of these in here are the ones that I kind of keep that I, not all of them, but some are the ones that I just don't want to burn completely because I I could finish it, but I, at least if I have it, I can come in and smell it. I probably won't burn it anymore, but I'll just come in just to smell it. So I'll remember what it, I'm like, I could smell it and at least like, oh yeah, I remember it and it smells so good, but I'll never burn it because if I burn it, it'll be completely gone and I won't even be able to come in and smell it and remember what it smelled like. I'll always be able to come in and smell it at least, even if I can't burn it because it's not out anymore. So until that comes out again, I'm not going to burn any more of that because at least I can come in and smell the goodness of the smoked pumpkin woods. It's so good. Down here, birthday cake. This is one of my, probably my top favorite homeworks candle. I love this one. And I have that much left and that's the only one I have. I don't have any more backups of this one. That one is available again, but I haven't bought any more of that, but it's it's one of my favorites, if not my favorite. Sugar Plum Backberry, we have another one of those. Cranberry Pumpkin Cake. We have Kitchen Herbs, that's a really good one, and that's back out too as well. But I have that one, it's, I burned some of this one. This is, uh, I had two of those, and this was the second one when I got that last year, I believe. We have Holiday Wreath. That is really hard to read in that, on that. That glare is so bad. There you go, you can kind of see it. Yeah, Holiday Wreath. Uh, let me see. And then Homeworks, we have another Coconut Palm. And actually I bought a trio of those, the Coconut Palm and the Key, key Lime Pie. And what was the other one? Oh gosh, I can't remember that. It was like pom pomegranate or something or other. I bought a set of that and then right after I bought it, Homework sent me some for PR. So I had two different sets. So I still have two of those. I've never burned the coconut palm one yet. And then we have, and I don't think I've burned the key lime macaron either. Uh, I actually had another one, but I gave one to my sister because she was like wanting some of my candles. So I gave my the one I bought to my sister. All right, Marigold and Mint from Homeworks. And then we have Homeworks Vanilla Cherry Blossom. This was from the TSV, I think last summer. 
2020, 21, I can't remember. I think it was 20, 2020, I think. I burned just a little bit of that one. And then we have Scentworks Pumpkin Spice. And we have Scentworks Cashmere Pumpkin. We have Bath and Body Works Banana Walnut Muffin. That's amazing. I love that Banana Walnut Muffin. Okay, now let's see. I have some of the back here that I'm trying to get to. Let me put some of these candles down here on this shelf I have down here. Okay, we have Pumpkin Fireside from Bath and Body Works. I love that. That was so good. And that hasn't came back either. So I have that much left in that one. Pink Bubblegum. That was from the Sweet Shop collection. It smells exactly like bubblegum. Pumpkin Pecan Waffles. This was from like 2014. This was like when Pumpkin Pecan Waffles was... Pumpkin Pecan Waffles was like at its height. The height of Pumpkin Pecan Waffles right here. It was so good. This one right here. I just for some reason keep this one because this has been out many times and it still comes out. But yeah, I don't know. I just want to keep this one for like keepsakes because that was like... That was like... When it, it was like the best. Then I have a London Tea and Lemon. That was like right when it first came out. Some of these are just sentimental to me, so I don't want to burn them. I just want to keep them. Because I just don't want to burn them. I know I could, but I just don't want to. And then my very favorite Bath and Body Works candle, Banana Nutmeg Bread Pudding. I will not burn this one at all. Because this has not came out again. Did it come out again as, what was it, Pumpkin? Pumpkin banana bread muffin or something or other. What was it called? I cannot remember now. It was very similar, but I feel like this was better. I just feel like this one was better. Pumpkin banana muffin, I think, or something like that. This one, I did, it was just the original. Loved it. I haven't burned this one at all. This, of course, was an extra one that I had. I think like a third or fourth one I've had or something. I don't know. Yeah, I won't burn that one ever. We have spice right here. This one I haven't burned because it's super strong. I like, this is headache inducing to me. It's such a strong red hot cinnamon spice scent. I just, I can't burn it anymore because it's so strong. So I just keep it there. Unburned. And then down here we have tomato vine. That is amazing too. And that hasn't came back either. So I have half of that burned. But I won't burn the rest of it because it's amazing. I love just to come smell it. Let me smell it real quick. Oh, God, it's so good. It is so authentic to tomato vine. It's amazing. Berry pumpkin waffle, or I'm sorry, berry pumpkin strudel. That is a favorite of mine, too. I love it. I won't burn any more of that because it hasn't came back either. I think it came out in something similar, but different name. But I don't know. I feel like the originals are just even better. They're like They, they kind of repackage them with a slight twist. I thought there was something else that was out that was kind of like it, but I still don't think it was exactly like it. But yeah, I have half of that one. And then we have Rome Pizzeria. This smelled like pizza exactly. Very oregano-like in there too. Um, I have this one. I actually got another one because this one I burned and then I put the lid on it, but it's, the lid got suctioned on there because sometimes if you put the lid on right after it's really hot, you don't want to do that because the lid will get suctioned on there and you cannot get it off or anything. I learned the hard way with this one because it would not come out. So my son Marco was trying to get it off and he was trying and trying and trying. I'm like, don't try anymore because you're going to break it. He would not give up on it. And of course it broke. So the glass here on the side broke when he was trying to get it off. So he ended up going and getting me another one because he broke this candle. So I burned the other one and then I just kept this one. Kind of like a keepsake because this is a kind of a novelty like candle to me because it smelled exactly like pizza and oregano so i just kept that i probably won't burn that one i just want to keep it for like a keepsake so yeah a lot of these i won't burn just because i want to keep them they're just like sentimental to me and i just i just like having them to come back and smell and if and you know i could burn them but then if i burn them i won't be able to come in here and smell them at all ever and i won't i'll be like gosh i wish i still had it so i could come in and smell it at least because a lot of these they haven't made anymore so that is it for the candles, and then I have just my little, a few pedestals back here. I have my homeworks, or Bath and Body Works snowflake pedestal, and then I have some homework, homeworks pedestals back there. Oh, and that's a Bath and Body Works pedestal there. 
I just have them stored back there. 